So, it's crazy how time flies. Uh, it seems like it was just yesterday that we were over in the 7th grade section of sneakers. Uh, I remember the first time I ever went to, I lost a shoe uh, underneath the bleachers and there was someone had to help me go get it. Uh, but, uh, you know, here we are. It's, kind of, it's just crazy how fast it goes by. Uh, I've talked to these guys all year about how how easy it is in a game like football to, uh, to play out of hate, to play out of anger for your opponent. And uh, I've said all year that that isn't what we're about. And uh, what makes us special is that we choose to play out of love for each other. And uh, for those coaches over there, and for our families, and for this school. And, uh, you know, get to go out there and play and wear the CAC on the side of our helmets is something special. Because we know that this school is a school that gave us an education. And this school is a school that gave us relationships with some of our very best friends. And we know that this school is a school that gave us a foundation for our relationship with the Lord. And the guy from Fayetteville knows what it's like for the guy from Colorado to come in here and to come to a school where he's accepted and where they're loved. And we all understand that God put us in Central Arkansas Christian for a reason. And because of that, we're going to play for each other tonight, one last time. And, uh, you know, I know for me personally, with this, I'm really close to this group of seniors. And, uh, and I'll play out of love for the two guys that I grew up playing football with on the playground. And uh, out of love for the guy that I played elementary basketball against. And now he's one of my very best friends and a great teammate. And uh, out of love for the guy from Colorado who came in not knowing a soul. I of love for the guy who moved here in junior high from Fayetteville, who's a very good friend of mine, a very good teammate. I of love for the guy who's worked his tail off to become one of the very best players of his position in the state. And I of love for the guy who would give everything he had to play one last game as a Mustang. Uh, for this group of seniors, you know, tonight's the last time I've ever played together. And, uh, you know, we've, we've been together for a real long time now. Uh, we played around 70 games together, um, about 500 practices together. We played like men. We played for men like uh, Coach Wilson, uh, Coach Sullivan, uh, Coach Ryan, uh, Coach Hutt, Coach Taylor, Coach Shaw. Uh, you know, and I personally look up to guys like Coach Cruz over there, Jesse Gates, you know, Trent Morgan, Drew Stringfell, DJ Williams, Joe Adams, Ryan Farr. I couldn't wait till I could grow up and be just like them and be in their shoes. And, uh, you know, it's here. Tonight's the last time that I'll ever get to do this. And uh, anybody that knows me knows how much the game of football means to me. So it's tough. Um, and it's crazy because it's like, when we were little, all us little kids would go and we'd stand outside the field house and we would wait for the team to come out so we could get high fives from the big guys. And uh, here we are, about to come out of that locker room and play our last game as the big guys. And, uh, you know, it's, it's crazy how time flies. And, uh, you know, I'll always value relationships over championships. And the relationships that I've made as a result of being a Mustang have made, have made everything worth it. Um, you know, it's, it's been a great ride. And I'm thankful for all the support that you guys have provided. Um, I think I can speak on behalf of all the seniors when I say that we'll be Mustangs forever. Thank you guys for the support over the years. Go Mustangs.